this out. It's called Rock Your School. Rock Your School. Rock, Rock Your School. school. The school. Fun and interactive themes. We did a NASCAR theme because we're calculating speed. It helps me when I learn. So I've got Wade and Hope King, the co-founders of Get Your Teach On. Can you kind of explain to us what is this program? I mean, there is absolutely no reason that we should be cheering louder for football teams, for basketball teams, right. than we are for our teachers and for our students. And that is what Rock Your School is all about. Get Your Teach On chose to be in Tampa to kick off their worldwide initiative. How does that feel this morning? Oh, it feels awesome. And what better place to kick off than Tampa Bay, right? Sometimes when you're in a transformation school, you don't know how burnt out you are. All you know is to show up every day keep pouring into the students, keep pouring into the students, and sometimes your cup is empty. Being a former student, like, my heart is here. I'm from Tampa, Florida. I was born and raised right here off of 22nd and Sly. Um, it is not the best neighborhood. 90% of our students receive free or reduced lunch. You know, you never want to stand before children who are facing so much and you don't have that fire. About a year ago, we all went to Orlando and had an opportunity to experience Get Your Teach On. It definitely ignited a fire in all of us that went that we didn't know that we needed. Students have to see that education is fun. So often you'll see uh, students sitting and complying, but are they engaged? And in this neighborhood, if we don't engage them, someone else will. So Rock Your School will give them an opportunity to see that this is my safe place. This is where I'm happy. These people do care about me. Rock Your School allows the teachers to pull out their best lesson that they've ever wanted to teach and give it to the students. Every teacher that you will see demonstrating their lessons, their heart is here. They're passionate. Uh, they close the school out most days with the custodial staff. Um, our community needs a positive day like Rock Your School just to let them know Sly's here, we're not going anywhere, and we're on our way. Coming back to Sly for me was like a call home, returning home, because I can share with my students, I am you, you are me, like this is what you can be and so much more. My role here at Sly is in partnership with my Bullet Family Foundation is to continue to help create and change the culture and the sixth highest zip code for children living in poverty in the entire state of Florida. One thing Rock Your School does for the teachers is it shows that like you're not alone. It's a profession which people don't make a lot of money. It comes with a lot of responsibility, a lot of trauma, but I think Hope and Wade have created this space of creativity and support and energy that can be so infectious when it comes to showing people really how fun and how engaging the profession of teaching can be if you just think outside of the box. And that's what I think education needs. It needs a push in the positive direction. It's about helping invest in a culture that creates championship people. From the moment they stepped on campus today, the kids knew that something special was happening. It has been phenomenal to watch the Rock Your School movement grow in OCPS, Orange County Public Schools. As a district, we take pride in supporting our teachers. So we really try to find ways to create equitable experiences for all of our schools because we are a very large district, eighth largest in the nation. When we first rolled out Rock Your School as an initiative, it really began because I recognized that we had pockets of schools, little silos, sort of participating on their own. So I thought, why not use the district's resources and the district talents to really put together a comprehensive support system for Rock Your School. With that first implementation in year one, we probably had about 60 to 70 schools that participated. 
And now we're over 110 schools. It's not only motivating and exciting for our students, it's motivating and exciting for our whole community. We've got you know, PTA members that are coming, we've got school board members that are a part of the initiative, all the way from bus drivers, cafeteria workers, everybody on campus making a joyful learning environment because that's the goal. Student engagement was not an issue today. Every single one of those students wanted to be a part of that lesson, wanted to be engaged, wanted to you know, get the right answer, wanted to know the answer in case they were called on. So there's nothing more rewarding for a teacher than watching your kids want to learn. Coming together with the United theme and doing it all kind of as a district together is just so much more powerful because then we have this presence and we have this commonality and on that Rock Your School Day, we are all together. We're all one OCPS. Being a parent has for sure changed everything. Here's the bottom line. Every day when children walk into your classroom, mm -hmm. that is somebody's whole world. Whole world. And as a teacher, we have to understand that. But also as a parent, we have to understand that teachers have a lot on their plates. And recognizing that we are all on this journey to make students as successful as possible. When we started thinking about Rock Your School, I don't think we realized the impact that it was going to have. And we're seeing it over 100,000 educators across the world right now are, are participating in, in teaching kids just like this. We said, how can we bring a community together that says today is the day? Today you don't have to be alone. Today you don't have to be isolated. You are surrounded by now 100,000 educators globally. We love being able to show up for educators because educators show up for students every single day. Who's showing up for the educators? We love to be able to be the community that provides that. Teachers don't need a lot. They didn't get into this profession to make a lot of money. They got into it to serve. And this provides an opportunity to celebrate that, celebrate the sacrifice that they're making, but also celebrate the fun that they're having with their students and allowing the community, again, to get back in there. And the community is hungry. People outside of teaching, they're, they're hungry to just contribute. They just don't know how. And this provides an opportunity, which was a day and is now a week, for community members to just pour back in to kids and teachers. I love Rock Your School and the whole initiative. I think what uh, Wade and Hope are doing, it's just amazing. And I love being a part of it because school and education should always be your top priority. Engagement is about connections. And connections are about taking our content and connecting it to our learners. Then we're not just teaching from a book, we're not just teaching from a textbook, we're teaching from ourselves and who we are, and that's what's gonna bring those lessons to life. And show up as you. Your kids need you for you, they don't need you to be someone else. Teachers are rock stars. If you're an educator and you're showing up for your kids and you are pouring into them and getting to know them and you're giving it your all, I mean, rock your school is every day of the year.